Yeah. Right, want to get right to our weather alert. Let's check your forecast now with Dave Aguilera. Is uh, snow still coming down outside? It is still coming down. Very light, albeit, but it is uh, coming down out there. Temperature-wise, man, we are cold out there. Uh, 25 down here at uh, CBS4, but look at Highlands Ranch there at 18 down there. Castle Rock right now is at uh, 17 degrees uh, at the moment. So very cold in the, that area. Here's a look at the uh, satellite and radar together and you can see a little bit of light snow from oh from Denver pushing up towards Weld County and beyond. So just very, very light stuff popping here and there enough to make a, kind of a coating across some of the uh, side streets. Uh, if you're on the major thoroughfare, CEDAW has really uh, handled it well. But uh, on the side streets coming out of the neighborhood, you might have a little little more uh, problem going on there. Here's what I'm expecting now as far as snowfall goes we could see from Denver to Fort Collins maybe a half inch to an inch by the end of the day today from Denver down to about Monument Hill it's going to be more uh, close to about one to two inches uh, the way things look right now let's take it full and we'll go through the numbers for you here we should have a high of only 25 degrees and there's a look at our tech center camera you can see just wet roads going on there not uh, too bad at all uh, as if you run really get cold go up to Craig they are four below zero right now now, most of our temperatures, Boulder, Greeley, Fort Collins in the 20s here. But if you factor in the wind chill, uh, like Greeley right now, feels like 9, feels like 10 at Fort Collins, feels like 9 at DIA. 14 below is the wind chill right now in Breckenridge. So let's find where this storm is. It's down there in Arizona. The center of it is pushing through, now just making it uh, into the Four Corners area. Once this moves into the Oklahoma Panhandle in Kansas, we'll see a little more upslope, and that'll happen uh, during the course of the day. So there we go. By 1130, flurries for Denver, northeastern Colorado, the front range here. Same thing by afternoon, a little more snow in the mountains as well. And then by tomorrow morning, everything should start to clear out and things Things will look uh, all bright and sunny by then. Bigger snowfall from Colorado Springs down through Pueblo, about two to four inches of snow there, four to eight in some of the Sangre de Cristos, and even a little bit more down there in the San Juans, about five to ten in the mountains north of Pagosa Springs. And there again is a look at the snow that we're expecting by the end of the day today, so it's just not going to be a whole lot for us. Temperature-wise, not going to warm up much, 20s and teens across the state. Uh, so 25 ought to be the high in Denver today, 41 uh, for the high tomorrow, so clearing out, but not as cold as what we had today. And if you want 50s, we got it Thursday and Friday. Should finish up the week in the upper 50s. Might be just a little breezy as well. Next weekend, if you're wondering about that, 49 on Saturday, 51 on Sunday. Should be a dry weekend headed your way. Always worried about the weekend, aren't we? We are. We think about the weekend Already. like on a Monday. I'll bet. Yeah. Pretty wild. <laughs> Alrighty, Dave. Thanks See so much. Guys. So you can bet the roads today will be pretty.